Reflective Fashion Production. My name is Monica. I'm really excited about today's episode of Like, Love, and Luxury. We're going to add a few new products into our luxury bag. Also, we're going to be talking about the Extra Body Sculpting Foam. I'm really excited because I actually got to use this on a person, and I'm going to tell you what I think and which one do I like, love, or is it going to be added into my luxury bag. But before we get started, let me tell you this disclaimer. So all the products that I use in this video are Paul Mitchell products. In any interest, you should check them out at your local Paul Mitchell salon, which is a cosmetology school. And that gives the opportunity to students to actually learn and use style-like products. If you have any interest in purchasing them, you should definitely do it within the professional beauty salon. Okay. So I have a few new products that I want to add into the luxury bag, which I'm going to tell you is a part of Clean Beauty again. So I've added the anti-frizz shampoo, which is shampoo and conditioner, which now I'm going to have the hydrate shampoo and conditioner. Now, both of these have olive and oak in them. It helps moisturize your hair. It's really good for dry hair but not only that but this is also good for textured hair so even if you have extra curly hair or wavy hair you can still use these some shampoos and conditioners you you can't use or to make your hair a little brittle but with hydrate it's it's amazing i love it i think that it belongs in my luxury bag because you can never go wrong with a good shampoo or conditioner the reason why i say that is because you can also use the conditioner as a small treatment so you can leave your conditioner in for about five minutes you know with a little plastic bag on your head and um, take it off rinse it and you'll have a little small treatment through um, between salon visits I think that's really important and uh, when I say a little small treatment I'm gonna transition into the supercharge now the supercharge is a part of the instant moisture line that they have at Paul Mitchell and this is really important because I think that this is a uh, I'm dropping stuff this can be used as a small treatment and you can use this weekly and I think that that's important because we do a lot of us do tend to not moisturize our hair like we should and we don't have that um encouragement and i encourage everybody to grab this and put them put this in their luxury bag like that's not an option and the reason why i say it's not an option because you can use this weekly on your hair and you can leave it in your hair for three to five minutes and this my friends is a nice conditioner that you can use every week every week for your hair like between salon visits when you go to the salon and you feel like oh my god like I just need to wash my hair because I want to wash my hair. I don't I don't know how you feel about going to the salon and then washing your hair because when I used to go to the beauty shop when I was younger, I tried to hold my uh, hairstyles until I couldn't hold them no more. So I I don't know nothing about your life. I just I know about mine, but I also know that with Malia who plays sports. It's very important for us to at least wash our hair every week. If not every week, then every every three days because she's sweating and we need to, you know, hydrate her scalp and just clean her, clean her head. Like, that's very, very important. And that's something that I'm learning just with her practicing, like, almost every day. But because it's summertime, she only has workouts and she's working out, like, every other day maybe you know what twice a week and I think that her washing her hair every three days is beneficial especially when you're hydrating your hair and keeping up with treatments so this is the supercharge and I am definitely adding it into the luxury bag now I talked about the extra uh body sculpting foam I really enjoy using this now i use this on my dial head a lot because i like the way that the vo it brings volume to the fine hair so my doll has fine hair and when i use this i actually use this twice on a blowout 
So um, the first time I used it, I did use use it with a little concoction. I don't recommend that you concocting this with anything else. I would use this individually by itself. I will make sure it's it's shaken up very well and I would distribute dispense it down. Like don't hold it up because you have some of those foams that's hold held up. I would do it down because it does um come out a little bit watery but it definitely has like a little foam foam to it in, in your hand so you want to make sure that you do that and literally have your hair already in sections and just pull it through pull it through with your fingers and go ahead and blow out your hair now the reason why i say that i used the concoction with it it kind of made the hair stiff and it was very hard so i would definitely recommend using this alone and it also depends on the type, the texture of hair. So the texture of hair, if it's extra curly, if it's wavy, if it's fine, if it's just, you know, thick, it really just depends. And you just have to play around with it. I'm going to actually put this in the light bag only because I just, I'm just not done with it. Like I, there's more to learn about this, more to learn. Now, I have something that I'm going to move from the light bag to the luxury bag, and I believe it is the soft style quick slip. I believe that I did put this in the light bag because I just liked it, and I'm still learning about it, and I'm going to move it to the love because I actually use this alone. Now, normally, I, can, I have little concoctions that I do with blowouts, and I used this by itself and it was really good just on texture hair. It blew out the hair very well. Not only that, but it definitely makes the hair soft and you can pull your fingers through it. Some um, different types of products that you use. I mean, if you play around with just the products in your hand and you see like if it has film to it. And I'm starting to notice like some of the concoctions that I have have film to them. Like it just... It's like sticky to my hands and you don't want that, especially when you're putting it in someone's hair and then you realize like, oh my God, this is really stiff. Like, yes, you can work it out and eventually it'll look good, even though sometimes when you're using the flat iron and it might have a little steam to it or go, Shh, you don't want the hair to do that. You're not making bacon. Like, don't do that. That's not cool. So I'm, I'm moving this over to the love the love bag um is it gonna be my luxury i'm not really sure everybody has their own opinions on different types of products this is just my opinion and now i am complete with this episode of like love and luxury and i will see you guys later